That breaking news, the FBI is joining the investigation into the death of 24-year-old Robert Fuller. He was found hanging from a tree near Palmdale City Hall last Wednesday. Fuller's death was originally believed to be a suicide, but his family and the community have demanded an investigation. Here's what L.A. County Sheriff Captain Kent Wagner said about this investigation just a short time ago. Initially, we are going to do forensics on the, the rope that was involved. Physical analysis and uh, tests of serology nature by our crime lab. We'll also dissect the involved uh, knot structure to determine how they were tied. We're going to continue with the video canvas to see if we can identify any surveillance video or home video which captures the events around the scene. And as that investigation intensifies, the family of another black man who was found hanged last month wants to know if the two deaths are connected. KCAL 9's Tina Patel has a story. The families of these two men are disturbed and want the state to formally come in and conduct an independent investigation. Take a look at this video. Over the weekend, people gathered in Palmdale where the body of 24-year-old Robert Fuller was found in a tree last week. The coroner says the autopsy has been deferred pending additional investigation, but the sheriff's department has already told the family they believe Fuller committed suicide. Those family members say there's no proof of that. Now take a look at this photo of 38-year-old Malcolm Harsh. His body was found hanging a tree in Victorville in late May. San Bernardino County Sheriff's investigators do not believe foul play is involved, but we talked to Harsh's brother and he says it's suspicious to hear that another black man died by hanging. Immediately, I didn't want to connect both of them together, but the fact that uh, the cities are, you know, 50 miles away from each other, it was similar circumstances. It's kind of hard not to think that they were connected in some type of way. The two cases are in different jurisdictions, but family members hope the state can come in and see if there is any connection. Sheriff Villanueva is planning a virtual town hall to discuss the Palmdale case this afternoon. In downtown, I'm Tina Patel for KCAL 9 News.